on and chill on his... Now here, bring you my opinions on... You know, can we just skip the intro for now? Player, player one! one! It was barely even cheating! Neither a player or stoner actually downloaded a mod, so I guess the Rainbow Sing was just like a glitch or another no visor type thing. Which are both slightly more okay than mods, so... I'll take it! Player one legitimately! Fucking legitimately! I wasn't even throwing it fucking because screw that! Anyways, like the cast jumping into that freeze frame, let's leap into my opinions on Among Us Logic 33! But the imposter can change colors! Everyone's saying that this may or may not be the finale of AWO, but I honestly don't think it is. The way everyone in the cast got so riled up to play more games insinuates that they're probably gonna make more episodes and hopefully much less Friday Night Funkin. If they do Friday Night Funkin' Logic for five episodes in a row again, I'm just gonna, you know, make a very long rant video about that or something. Although I already am working on a very long video essay, so probably not that specifically, but you know what, let's just move on. A lot of characters getting bigger roles in this than they usually would, like B-Day, Rose, Sheriff, or even Mr. X, was a really nice touch to the episode. I guess they were kidding when they said they had plans for a lot of these characters. They did. I mean, Sheriff's role in this episode could easily have been done just as well by Bro, but they chose Sheriff just because they've used Bro more. And that's good. Maybe we can finally get an actual character for Goober that isn't just toned down dumb. And speaking of dumb, this is the first time in canon that we've had even a very brief moment of Nomex dumb, so that's fun. The ship is strengthening. Some decent dumb and engineer stuff is all that we need to complete it. But back on the topic of giving actual characters actual roles, they didn't even do that for the non-overused characters. Even some of the more overused characters got some good justice in this video. The plot of this episode was surprisingly unique for a new AUL, but they made it work. I really like the way that at the end they called back to how Mr. Cheese read our player at the end of Among Us Logic 2, only for this time for Stoner to do that to Rose in player's favor. And the little detail that every character that player and Stoner, you know, took on the voice of, was the characters that their voice actors also voiced. As in, like, Player got Veteran Sheriff's voices, and Stoner got Captain and Gentleman's. And Engineer, but he didn't actually use that voice. Probably because the reason that Engineer is even not used that much in episodes in the first place is because the voice is really difficult for the voice actor. Which I guess is reasonable, but still kind of annoying seeing that Dumb has to do that voice all the time, when that's probably pretty difficult as well. I mean, I have no inside knowledge, I'm just guessing, but, eh. Dumb's voice is probably a better impression for me than known right now, but, uh, still pretty difficult. Like this, um, hell, uh, this is kinda difficult, but still possible, I guess. I don't know why I just did that, I guess it was just to prove a point, but now my gnome impression just sounds a lot worse in comparison, so, uh, I'm not really sure not what to do now. I've pretty much covered all my points, so I guess it's time for a very hype. As it is, yay! yay!